ZT has been developed for years to make sure it can handle the long runs of marathon runners, and the dialed in for the necessary tempo runs throughout the training plan. With the new V12, New Balance has completely redesigned the shoe from the V11, and come out with a completely new version of their most popular trainer. Coming in at $160, this high cushion trainer will compete against the likes of the Brooks Glycerin, Hoka 11 Clifton, Saucony Triumph, and Endorphin, and more. So how does it stack up to the competitors? With the current iteration of the shoe, the cushion to me has fallen behind the likes of Brooks or Saucony. The toe-off is not nearly as snappy as the Saucony or Hoka. However, the upper is superior to almost any other shoe I've run in during the past two years. New Balance Fresh Foam X1080 V12 First Impressions When these shoes showed up, I was very excited to get them out and on my feet. I was very pleased with the colorway of navy blue and orange with the white Fresh Foam X midsole visible. Visually, they were a huge upgrade from the V11S.